Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a review on the newer ring light desktop stand. I purchased this ring light stand from Amazon for $15.99. It took about two days to receive and came packaged really well. If you're interested in this ring light stand, I will leave everything down in the description box. Okay guys, so here is my vanity and there's my ring light. I've had this ring light for over two years. I purchased it on eBay. It's a great ring light. I really love this ring light. It came with everything, came with the adapter for the phone. I love it. The only thing that bothers me about this ring light is the stand. The stand is really wide down at the base and it takes up a lot of room. Um, as you can see, my vanity is very far away from the wall. Um, there's a pretty big significant gap actually it's probably about eight inches worth of unused space just because of the base of the tripod um, I have to have it at that height um, oh yeah I wanted to stop and pause and show you guys that that's another reason I can barely walk through my bed in the vanity without banging my leg into the bottom of the bed anyways back to the tripod as you guys can see, the tripod is really wide and look, both of those back legs are touching the back wall. So I have this like at the max right now. It's open as far as I can open it with, I'm trying to keep it as tight as I can, but you know, it's just taking up too much room there. And as you can see, the top of it is also touching my table. So like that is as good as I can do with the base of the stand. So it has to be that far. Anyways, let's get into the unbagging. This is the package that the um, ring light stand came in. It came from Amazon. Came pretty quick. Uh, it took about two days. I got it early this morning actually. So this is the bag. There's just a box and no instructions in there. This is the package that it came in. Just the newer ring light stand. Here I go opening it. Oh my goodness. I hate doing voiceovers you guys. Anyways, here is the, the box inside the bag which also says newer, so it was a legit newer ring light desktop stand. And these are the pieces that were inside. Everything came pretty well packaged. Again, no instructions, so this must be easy, right guys? Yes, it is. <laughs> so you got that gold adapter piece, then you have the bottom black bracket, which is um, the stand, it's flexible. Um, here I am just opening it. Then there's a small hole, in that uh, bracket and that's where we're gonna use the screw. So I'm just placing it up inside that uh, hole and then we're gonna go ahead and just screw on that gold piece. Make sure that it's nice and tight. I was tightening it and as I was tightening it, it just kept on going and going and going. I did not strip that so I don't know. Maybe it just goes and goes. So there it is, look at that guys. It looks so nice, all right. Time to take my ring light off of that old stand and get it on this one. So I'm just unscrewing it from the back. There we go, girl, yes. Get your life. All right, we're gonna take that piece right there and we're going to attach it to the gold piece. Pretty simple, guys. This is not rocket science at all. So now you're just gonna tighten that uh, back piece as tight as you can get it. And I was noticing it was really wobbly and I was like, oh no, guys. I got a defective one, why is it wobbly, wait, and then I figured out. There are uh, little soft, they look like silicone pieces uh, or soft pieces like padding on the bracket and I had it upside down, I had the black piece upside down so I'm just gonna take it and look, see you guys, those little pads, they have to be touching the surface so I just flipped it around, easy fix, right? Um, and then we're just gonna go ahead and screw that back on. I was gonna edit this piece out, but I figured if I did it, somebody else might do it too and think that something was wrong with this stand, which there's nothing wrong with it. We just, I had it upside down. So take two of putting the ring light back onto the stand. So we're just gonna go ahead and tighten it as well as you can or as tight as you can. And look at that guys. I'm just adjusting it because of where I had it prior but it's really sturdy. I was really, really pleasantly surprised because this is an 18 inch uh, ring light, you know? So now I'm just um, pushing my vanity back against the wall, trying to get all of the room that I can. 
putting down my ring light. Yes, it looks so much nicer. Oh, turned it on to make sure everything's still working. Girl, it's still working. It looks great. Look at that. Look at all that room. I still have lots of room on my vanity for my makeup, which is great. I love it. This looks so nice. It looks so cute, so sleek. It looks expensive, and it was only $15.99, you guys. It looks awesome. I love it. Now I just want to go ahead and show you how much space I have. Now that we got that old tripod out of the way, look how much room I have back there, you guys. I pushed that vanity back, and now look. I have so much more room. So much more room. I can walk through my bed in the vanity. I could do a two-step. Girl, I could dance. Ooh, I'm so happy right here, y'all. Look at that. I used to run into that right there. Ugh. Anyways, I'm really, really happy with that. It looks so good. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you how to adjust the legs. Um, you can move them. I have them facing back. You can have those legs turned around facing forward. It's whatever you want to do. If you have this on a desk or on a small surface or on a vanity, you can move it around and adjust it to the way that you need it to be. So. I'm just moving everything back and trying to maximize the surface space as much as I can. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put my mirror back on my vanity. I got this mirror from Ikea, and as you can tell, it looks like the top of that mirror is gonna be blocking the vision on um, when I'm recording, because I use my phone to record my videos. Yeah, see I have the phone and you can see my mirror, so while I'm doing my tutorials, you're gonna see that. So I'm going to go ahead and just start moving things around and see what kind of hack I can come up with you guys and voila, it worked. So there is my ring light stand, my mirror. I just took the ring light and placed it on top of the mirror and that's the only thing it took. Just that little bit of height right there. Actually move that mirror down out of the uh, visual space. Hey, yes, I love it you guys. Look how good this looks. So guys, that's it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and that it was informative. If you guys have any questions, send me a comment and I will again leave everything down in the description box, all the links to everything that I mentioned. So hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye.